Baldwin spoke on a podcast hosted by former CNN anchor Chris Cuomo. That will right. not make sense to people. If a bullet comes out of a gun, they say, well, then someone fired. You're familiar it in your with hands. this did not come from me. This came from the DA's office themselves. You're familiar with what fanning a gun is. Have you heard of that phrase, fanning a gun? Yes, but explain So it. if you pull the hammer back and you don't lock the hammer, if you pull the hammer back pretty far, in old Western movies, you'd see someone fan the hammer of the gun. The hammer didn't lock. You pulled it back to an extent where it would fire the bullet without you pulling the trigger. The actor also repeats his claim that he was told the gun was safe that fateful day. I didn't know the gun was loaded. He didn't know, he didn't know the gun was loaded. Baldwin's interview with Cuomo came as an FBI report revealed its own tests show the gun could not be fired without a pull of the trigger, contradicting Baldwin's account, which he first told George Stephanopoulos nine months ago. I didn't pull the trigger. So you never pulled the trigger? No, no, no. I would never point a gun at him and pull a trigger at them, never. Walls close in on Alec Baldwin as his gun life falls apart. Have I got your attention now? Goes today's opinion piece in the New York Post. We spoke to firearm safety expert Steve Wolf. The process of fanning a revolver involves pressing the trigger or applying pressure to the trigger. And while maintaining that pressure, pulling the hammer back and releasing it. And every time we do that, You'll see the cylinder rotates and the hammer falls. It's certainly possible that he wasn't aware that he was pressing the trigger because it's not a large deliberate action. Okay. Baldwin's yeah. lawyer says the FBI report is being misconstrued. Meanwhile, the criminal investigation by the Albuquerque DA continues. I'm waiting and waiting and waiting. And then the announcement is going to come about who is or isn't going to be charged. The process is slow. I am deeply, deeply, deeply resentful and bitter about how slow the process has been. All right, let's get this nightmare over with. <laughs> the interview ends on a note of dark humor. I told people I'm going to be a greeter in Vegas any day now. I'm going to be, remember me, I was in Beetlejuice. How are you, everybody? Please, table nine, Frank, table nine. You ask me if I have a God complex? Let me tell you something. I am God.